Chairperson, I thank you for this opportunity. Honorable Minister for Railways, Mr. Ashwini Vaishnavji, I wish to state that as policymakers and being a part of the legislative, we have the highest responsibility in ensuring the well-being of our senior citizens, without whom neither of us nor this country would have prospered. I also wish to state that as policymakers, we need to take care of the interests of the fourth pillar of our democracy, that is the press and media. However, sir, the 50% concession on train tickets given to our senior citizens and the accredited press media, which was provided until the March 2020 lockdown, has still not been res restored in spite of the repeated fervent appeals by the senior citizens and various media forums of our country. I urge the Honourable Minister to restore this 50% concession on train tickets to the senior citizens and the press and media, sir. Sir, and another humble request is to restore the concession, the monthly seasonal ticket concession given to the student community that was provided until the March 2020 lockdown. And another request, sir, that a long pending demand of a new railway line in my Trichy constituency from Tanjav, Tanjavu to Madurai via Gandharvakote and Pudukote has been ignored in this budget and as well as the previous budgets. Sir, this railway line, new railway line, was surveyed and sanctioned in the year 2012 and 13, and even mentioned in the 2018-19 Pink Book of the Railways. I request the Honourable Minister to provide the required funds and do the necessary to complete this railway line from Tanjavu to Madurai via Gandharva Kota and Pudukote. This railway line would be a major boost to the social economic development of the backward areas of Pudukote and Gandharva Kota. It would also aid the development of industries in Madurai and Pudukote districts. It would also provide a major fillip to the temple tourism in Tanjavu, Pudukote and Madurai. Sir, Another request is to commission the railway overbridge at Travel Crossing 376 Pudukote town at the earliest since at the earliest since it was entered in the 2023-24 Pink Book of the Railways. I also request to bring to your kind attention that the railway overbridge proposal at Karveli Palam Gate, located near Sipkot Pudukote, has been found to be fit for implementation. As per the survey done by the railways, I humbly request the Honourable Minister to approve the ab above railway overbridge at Pudukote at the earliest and provide necessary funds, sir. As highlighted earlier by my senior colleague, Mr. Selva Ganapati, more than seven new railway lanes in Tamil Nadu, which were approved 13 years back, have not been commissioned, and even in the, it has been neglected in the current budget. Uh, sir, even in the current budget, rupees, the, the rupees 6,360 6, crores uh, fund allocation is terribly insufficient to complete these seven projects, uh, already pending projects, sir. So the allocation of rupees 14,730 crores to Madhya Pradesh, 15,940 crores to Maharashtra, and 19,848 crores to Uttar Pradesh clearly indicates a step attitude of the union government towards Tamil Nadu. Sir, is this indifference by the union government towards Tamil Nadu, is, is it because of the fact that Tamil Nadu did not even give a single seat to the BJP alliance? I'm asking this question, sir, because a senior leader belonging to the BJP alliance in Tamil Nadu recently quoted in public saying that Tamil Nadu will not get the fair share from the centre because it, the Tamil Nadu public did not vote for the BJP alliance, sir. Sir, I humbly request kindly that the union vote. government shall not kindly, be prejudicial to conclude. the interests of the uh, uh, people you of Tamil Nadu the and, and that Tamil Nadu shall get, shall get its share, fair share of projects Raiko, and funding for the centre. Can you address to the chair and please try to conclude? Sir, okay. Thank I conclude, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. I humbly again, sir, request that the centre government, central government, the union government shall be, shall not be prejudicial to the interests of the people of Tamil Nadu and that Tamil Nadu shall get its fair share of funds and projects, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Sri Robert Bruce. Thank you, ma'am. Sabana Agravale, Malay Wanakam. Manbuki in the Avail, Yenude Mudel Ure, 